children now we are going to do physics lab activity this experiment from motion and measurement of distances do you know what measurement is measurement is an activity that compares an unknown quantity with a standard known quantity in day to day life we measure the length of a pencil the width of a book and height of a person and etc now today in this session let us find how to measure the thickness of a coin the aim of an experiment is to measure the thickness of a coin to conduct this experiment required materials coins and scale now let us discuss the theory of this experiment measurement is the technique developed for correct judgment of dimensions of various objects very small lengths like thickness of a coin is expressed in centimeter dear students it is not easy to measure the thickness of a coin with scale so we measure the thickness of few coins and from that we can calculate the thickness of a coin as below thickness of a coin is equal to thickness of total coins by number of coins now let us discuss the procedure take 20 five rupee coin place these coins one on the other with the help of measuring scale measure the thickness of 20 five rupee coins vertically observation total number of coins is equal to 20 thickness of total coins is equal to 3.7 cm thickness of one coin is equal to thickness of total coins by number of coins thickness of one coin is equal to 3.7 cm by 20 thickness of one coin in centimeter is equal to 0.185 cm convert centimeters into millimeters 1 cm is equal to 10 mm thickness of one coin in millimeters is equal to 0.185 into 10 thickness of one coin in millimeter is equal to 1.85 mm By using above method we can measure the thickness of a page in a book or thickness of a playing card etc precautions make sure to place the scale along the thickness of the coin if the edge of the scale is worn out or broken the measurement can be started from any other mark that is fully clear i should be brought exactly above the point on the scale where the measurement is to be taken based on this experiment i'll ask a few questions the first question can we use the length of a hand span as a standard measurement why anyone would like to answer for this question The answer is no because the length of a hand span is different for different people. The second question is what is the SI unit of length? Anyone else? The answer is the SI unit of length is meter. And the third question is what is the least count of meter scale? Anyone would like to answer for this question? The answer is the least measurement that can be made accurately with an instrument is called its least count. So, least count of meter scale is one millimeter.